it's just really good to be back to a little bit of sense of normalcy, being back at the ballpark and seeing the Cardinals tonight. Hi, this is Jeff Marsacci, the Plain English Attorney, and I'm an author, certified Medicaid planner, and an attorney with more than 25 years of experience running my own firm. You're at the number one place to learn about not only estate and Medicaid planning, but to get business, fitness, and general life success stories. I want to help estate planners and the general public get the tools and advice they need to stay safe, plan ahead, and enjoy life. Sachi, the plain English attorney, and I am here at the world famous Durham Bulls Athletic Park, and we're going to talk about masks. Now, I'm not talking about the catcher's masks or anything like that. It's that we've reached that point in the vaccination cycle, in the pandemic, that the governor has lifted almost all the mask mandates. But the, the thing we want to talk about is what exactly does this mean? And what's it gonna mean specifically inside my office. All right, if you've gotten your double vaccination or you got the Johnson & Johnson and you're more than two weeks past, the studies are saying, look, you're gonna be fine. There's still a very small chance you could get the virus, but it's not really hitting people the way it would if they did get the vaccine. In fact, some people are hardly noticing they're just testing positive and it's like, yeah, maybe I got a little bit of a headache, but nothing major is going on. All right, so what does this mean for restrictions? When you're talking about private companies and things like the Durham Bulls Athletic Park, it's still kind of private property, corporate property. They still get to make a lot of the rules. So if a place is still saying, no, if you want to do business with us, you've got to have your mask on, that's it. Right now, when we're filming this, Major League Baseball, which governs the minor league teams under it, they haven't made decisions or we haven't heard of any big decisions on whether or not to lift the mask mandates. So we're just gonna go ahead and wear our masks in the park. Then there's the other question, is it just a good idea? Look, there's still a lot that's unknown. There's still a lot of people who aren't vaccinated. You're going to end up in a place where it's crowded and you don't know if everybody's been vaccinated or not. Like if you're going into a business store, it might be a good idea just to wear the mask anyway. I was at the gym this morning and the signs were all changed. It's not mandatory, but it's recommended to wear masks. So what did I do? All right, while I was doing a workout in a specific set area, I wiped everything down. There was no one within six feet. In fact, there was no one within 12 feet of me. So I didn't have the mask on. But the minute someone was coming over and they were wearing a mask out of courtesy, I put mine on. So I'm gonna go in the store, I'm gonna put my mask on. All right, so we don't have our usual seats with everything getting shuffled around, but I wanted to show you the seats we kind of lucked out on. So, here's where I get to watch the game from. Okay, so what exactly is the policy on masks going to be in the office? All right, I'm going with the combination of the CDC guidelines and a higher medical authority, my father, the doctor. If you are fully immunized and two weeks past that final shot, so in other words, you've gotten both Pfizer or Moderna's, or you got the one Johnson & Johnson, and you're two weeks past, Okay, you don't have to worry about wearing a mask. Just let us know you're fully immunized, you're more than two weeks past, and anyone on my staff who is also more than two weeks past will take our masks off. 
if you're not, all right, then we're going to wear masks to protect you. And then yet a third thing, look, if you are fully immunized and you're just more comfortable with us wearing masks, no problem, just let us know and we're happy to put them on too. So those are the guidelines, very simple. I'm glad that things are opening up, but we're still gonna be a little bit cautious. It's just really good to be back to a little bit of sense of normalcy, being back at the ballpark and seeing the girls. So it's been 20 months since I've been able to get into a game. So it does kind of feel a little bit like coming back. and simple and straightforward and as always please stay safe plan ahead and enjoy life and make it a great day we hope you found that information useful and easy to understand to keep getting this great information please like subscribe and turn on notifications to get even more information more quickly follow the links below to some of our free no obligation programs